it's the weekend, Easter weekend, Saturday today. I thought I'd do a quick video. This is not going to be a long one because I was supposed to do um, a pair of trousers and show you how I made them. Um, the style I made was uh, the bin bag sort of style. I was going online, I was scrolling through to see what type of thing will inspire me and that did. I have one already that I bought from a store. Um, I had one that I bought from Zara, one that I bought from H&M, I think it was. And they both look like I am wearing a bin bag. So I thought, let me try one myself and see if I can make one that fits exactly to my body type. And it came out okay-ish. Uh, I'll show you how it looks like. I was just basically scrolling through online to see what I can make during this time. I'm freaking bored out my mind. Um, I'm working from home. I do have to sometimes go into work because I work in healthcare, but um, luckily my job role I can do mostly at home. So I just thought, let me just show you a few things and then you could tell me what you think. So we're at home. Um, it's the first Easter that I'm not going to spend with my family. Uh, with my mum and my dad and my brother and stuff and probably won't see any of my cousins and aunties which I feel kind of like mm, about but it's okay because we have video call I'll send them some messages and we'll eat as many chocolates as we can it's nice and sunny outside which is great because I'm staying inside well you know what that's life so I just thought let me just show you you can tell me what you think I am trying to keep as positive as possible in this time. I mean, a lot has happened in the last few weeks that could bring down any normal person. But obviously, with this is going to be our lives for a little while. And there's going to be a lot of obstacles in life, generally. And learning how to go with the punches, no matter how bad it is, and keeping your faith at the same time is one of the greatest tasks in the world in your life that you can do growing up and especially as I have a child at home trying to keep as positive as possible is key because the minute you start acting down they will also follow suit and I don't want that so that's that so let me know what you think of the trousers I'll show you a little clip and I'll be back soon here yeah. That is the quick, quickest video uh, I've made. Um, so I don't know where I put the video of me making it. So I might, if you want to see, um, do another video of me making a pair of trousers or not. It depends. Um, I have ordered some fabric uh, and due to the fact that there's not that many stuff at the warehouses right now, I have no idea when I'm going to get them. Um, that fabric itself, I actually got it from MP Silk like a couple of years ago, and I just had some extra. It was supposed to be long length, well, because I had, I was just using leftovers, I just did it the length that I could do, which was like a quarter length trousers. It didn't come out too bad, and it's a wrap around sort of trousers, and they do come through the seam. I do feel like they could be better. Um, I just did it because I was bored and I got a bit impatient at the end. So the next time I do it, I will try to take my time on it. But yeah, let me know what it looks like. Right now, it's past lunchtime. Way past lunchtime and I haven't even made anything to eat for my daughter. So I need to do that. But yeah, let me know what you think. Leave a comment. Um, I will try to get a better picture for my Instagram page feed. So you can see what it looks like with the finishing touches. But yeah. 